Good day, everybody. Mike Flores here, local Las Cruces realtor and sales director for Monarch Homes. Thank you so much for joining me today. Today, we are going to tour a 2,384 square foot home with a ton of amazing options. I can't wait to get started. Thank you so much for joining us. Take a look at this. Starting off with the outside look of this home, this is a Tuscan Mediterranean look. You have a 3070 roof. That means that 30% of it is gonna be pitched with tile. The other 70% will be what's called a parapeted roof. Beautiful front design, very, very high, uh, high walls, high ceilings, gorgeous layout, four coach lights, drop chandelier, gorgeous outside landscape. You got a rock arroyo, two boulders, lots of bushes, tree. You got a flagstone path for your guests and a very nice deep patio. Take a look how deep this is. I really love the design of this home. You got a very deep patio. If you're doing a Toscana or a Mediterranean, you have this really pretty rock stack that goes from one side of the home to the other. And it even comes actually into the patio space. I really like that design. Easy coach lights to change light bulbs. Eight foot garage door with windows. This garage is completely finished. I think you're gonna appreciate how this garage is finished off. It's got epoxy. Of course, it's got uh, insulation, paint, all that good stuff, garage door opener. And an eight foot garage door, as you can see, it's very very, very large and very useful. So coming into the front part of this, you have a window here, really nice little design inside of it, nice dark pop outs. And then you have this eight foot by 42 inch door accented or lit up, illuminated by an outside chandelier. Speakeasy glass, you got your video doorbell, a plug in, and of course the keyless entry. Take a look at the entry of this home. 16 feet up, two accent windows, and a drop chandelier. I mean, it makes the eight foot doors look tiny. <laughs> it's like, I know I look small compared to this space. This is very, very nice. So this is what your, your guests would see upon entry of this home. They walk in, there's this large foyer space, lots of plugins, and you notice a door that goes into the garage and then a barn door that we actually outfitted the front bedroom as an elaborated ensuite. Take a look at this. So you come in, and by the way, there's no carpet in this home except for in the theater room. Eight foot doors, nice full bathroom, three centimeter thick specialty granite, dark stained wood. You got this really pretty slate tile that goes all the way up to the ceiling. Couple of wet nichos, really nice. This is a, you don't usually see these in our guest bathrooms. Typically you see a regular shower head, but this is a very elaborate ensuite. You wanna make sure it's very, you know, it's very much like the model home or like the home um, itself in the master suite and try to make this as master suite as possible. And uh, we, I think we did a pretty good job. It's a very nice, you have your own coat closet with a little bit of linen space. So this home does have Pella windows, two inch louver blinds, fans in every bedroom, eight foot doors, 10 foot minimum ceilings. Again, no carpet. This is a 24 inch tile laid in straight lay with eighth inch grout lines. Lots of plugins. TVs designed to actually be there. You got a nice window here and then a walk in closet over here and what's cool about this you always have the nice view of either the front homes the front landscaping sometimes you get a little peak of the mountains it's fantastic now this home does have a sky view deck and i can't wait to show that to you that's fantastic but this one this room bedroom even has a window inside the closet how cool is that Wait till you see the kitchen on this home too. The, the entertainment value of this home is superiorly high. I think you're gonna love this design. And by the way, very grayish, like a soft gray color. So finished garage, insulated, painted, trimmed, textured, 10 foot ceilings, eight foot garage door. You got your, your garage door opener here is a bell driven. You got shelving over here. It's got a soft water loop. The home is equipped with the instant hot water. There's the pump right there. And then your drip system is here. Got a couple of plugins and then right behind you is some really good places to have storage. And believe me, as much storage as you can get, the better. All the new homes have that in common is a little bit of a lack of storage. So to have shelving built in, I think is very useful. Now this home, we did, we did arch the soffits. 
you have a clean nichos with three centimeter thick granite and you actually have two of them centered by your French doors with glass inlay going into the study. Now the study, it's very large, probably 14 foot wide. You got extra LED lights, heating and cooling vent, it's on window of course. And then you can even lock one of these doors into place if you wanted to, but really cool how these work. And of course the built-in stoppers are in the hinge. So look at the counterweight on this, see how that works. And you can loosen that up. All it takes is a screwdriver and you can loosen it up. You can make it more tighter if you want to stop there. You can make it stop there. It's really, really cool. Now notice we went to a bedroom, a bathroom, a garage, a foyer space, and a study. And we haven't gone to the rest of the quarters for the guests. And we, that means we still haven't gone to the living room space. Really nice laundry space, upper and lower cabinetry. Really nice lower countertop, three centimeter thick granite undermount light. Everything is soft closed from drawers to doors. It's very nice. You got your low voltage panel here. This is gonna be for your, all your low voltage items like your cable and your internet. It's fantastic. Everything's LED lights. And then you have your second full bathroom here, kind of similar to what you saw in the first bathroom with the slate tile, the three centimeter thick granite. It's got pop out mirrors, drop lights. You got the hardware down here, all satin nickel faucets, or satin nickel hardware, satin nickel faucets with Delta, under matted rectangular sinks. Fabulous design. And then you have the third bed, or actually the second bedroom we've seen would be this one here. Has a walk in, or a little bit of a closet, kind of a pop out, which left this really cool little alcove here. So if you have like a specialty dresser, this would be a good space for it. It's even got a plug in for you. And there's even a plug in inside the closet too. It's fantastic. Now, this over here was a bedroom, but we made it into a theater with a really cool, like a platform here and the way it's designed is to have a chair here a love seat down here and maybe a chair there and there's a floor plug in there and a, a side plug in on both of these and then as this is made to have your big tv here so you can fit i mean the sky's the limit you could probably even get a projector here and just do the whole thing fantastic use of space you got these really cool fans in every bedroom by the way um, self-balancing they come with remote controls The amazing thing about Monarch is a lot of things that you're seeing in this home is actually standard. There's not a lot of upgrades in here, um, especially when we're looking at the kitchen. There is not a single upgrade in this kitchen. So double stack kitchen cabinetry with glass inlay, all the hardware, herringbone pattern backsplash to the 10 foot ceilings, built in LG appliances, drop pendant lights, really beautiful stuff. The granite is very special. You have a trash can pull out over here. This is smart faucet, it's very nice. Floating garbage disposal switch here, trash can pull out here, and even stuff like this you'll find in Monarch throughout. Some pull outs, all on soft clothes, that's fabulous. And this is a gas cooktop, 36 inches to give you a size reference, and if you notice we go very in line with the actual shrouding, so it's kind of, it's very symmetrical. Now, from here, and by the way, undermount lights and lights in there are standard. And you got a glass pantry as well, glass pantry door. Goes all the way up to eight feet with the shelving and the 10 foot ceilings. And then, you know, looking here, this is just amazingly beautiful. So you have your dining room off this way with a drop chandelier, a floating ceiling with an accent light. You have a 12 foot tray in the gray room with four beams extra lights, helicopter fan, and then this gorgeous fireplace that goes from the floor up and it's quartz stack all the way up. It's a, it, this is actually a electric fireplace. There's a granite bonco and you even have lights under here. So it lights up underneath. This comes with a remote control and it does actually put off some heat as well. So custom mantle here, put your big TV there. You got your Marvin glass door, helicopter fan, floor plug. This is where you'd be watching TV. So even from the kitchen, you know, a little bit, maybe a little bit, a little bit from the dining room, you'd be able to see the living room space. It's a very, very open floor plan, just absolutely stunning. And I mean, if you think the inside is nice, wait till you see the outside backyard entertainment area. It's fantastic. So we go into the master suite here. 
Recessed tray with accent paint around the tray and then the hidden shelf has a light inside of it. So at nighttime, this tray illuminates beautifully. You have an accent window, another operable window here with blinds. Does, does come with screens, of course. One of the only floor plans that Monarch does that separates the master bathroom from the closet. And I think sometimes people really like that. Very, very large closet space. Another signature piece of Monarch, they finish off their closet spaces really nice with the ends of these. LED lights in here. And then a barn door with satin nickel finishes. You got the hardware here going into this gorgeous, I mean this master bathroom is probably my favorite design. You have a 67 inch freestanding tub, a 10 foot by four and a half foot shower, two sinks, you got your vanity, a full fluid piece of granite all the way across with the riser, three pop out mirrors, four drop lights, gorgeous, gorgeous design, everything on soft clothes and the reading room behind its own door. This is fantastic. And then look at the design of this. So frameless glass door. What that means is that you don't have anything overhead. So it's just completely frameless. You just walk in. So if you're six foot 10, you'll be okay. <laughs> and then you come in here. Now, oversized benches, wet nichos, rain shower heads, handheld soap dish, glass shrouds, and you have a mirror image of it right over here which is fabulous. And why, why we did this was because to get to that, to clean the shower head is a lot easier. Imagine trying to drop one from the 10 foot ceilings. It'd be like, hey, let's go get the ladder out, you know? <laughs> It'd be very, very hard to clean. If I haven't mentioned the pricing, this home right now, as it sits, is sitting in the 480s. Um, there is a little bit of incentives on this one. And if this fits the bill for what you're looking for, I highly recommend making an appointment. I know this home will not last long. We just got pictures of it yesterday. So fantastic home. Um, Monarch home, brand new 2024 model. Outside, you got a gas fireplace. You got your flat screen pre-wire. You got six LED lights above us. And then not only is the whole po the patio extended out, but they also put a really nice slab of concrete here to give you a little bit more of a landing space for the spiral staircase. I really love they did that. And we're backed up to a street called High Plains. In fact, we're in a community called Metro Verde, which is very close to Red Hawk Golf. But this is a very brand new community, no HOA, uh, lots of parks, lots of walking trails, lots of stuff for everybody to do. I actually live in this neighborhood, been here for about eight years, and I mean, it's been the best place I've ever lived. But really nice outside, you got some faux grass that's evergreen, never, <laughs> it stays that color its whole life. And then it's got a brick actual outlay or a frame around it. Very nice work and I can't wait to show this to you. Take a look at the Skyview deck. Now we are known for our views in Las Cruces, but when you're on top of a house and you don't have a lot of two stories around you or you have a pretty flat area, you get to see 360. I mean, I see the A mountain, that's over by University. That's right there. That's all the Oregon Mountain Range, the entire Oregon Mountain Range. Over this way, you have the Donianas, you have Mount Baldy, and you even have the Robletos over this way. So you get 360 views from a Skyview deck. And it is absolutely beautiful up here. Let me tell you, imagine the 4th of July up here. This would be fabulous. Really nice decking, this synthetic wood decking. You got this uh, wrought iron all the way around it. Kind of gives it a really cool look. Gorgeous. You know, Monarch Homes are just one of those builders where you come in and it's like, wow, like most of what is in this home is included. So what you see is truly what you get. And they are capable of doing some uh, nice little designs and customizations as you saw in this home as well. But super warm outside, by the way, we're in August, so excuse a little bit of sweat. I think I'll end it here in the kitchen. I wanna thank everybody as always for watching my videos. And if you have any questions about real estate in Las Cruces or just about the general area, give me a call today. I always look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you so much.